everybody, it's me Carmine DiStefano, the book man. Now I'm kind of a Mass Effect fan, but despite that, with the release of its latest title, I thought I would do this in a calm and orderly- Mass Effect! You can use the game you can vent the day. So what do I think about this so far? <laughs> well, I have to put it like this. It's not impressive in the sense of how it looks compared to games I've been playing recently, especially Horizon Zero Dawn. It's not as impressive graphically. But with that being said, the combat is more than what I would have hoped for, considering what it evolved from. For those of you that never played the Mass Effect games, if this is your first attempt at a Mass Effect game, let me tell you to bring it to you like this. The first Mass Effect, the combat was very slow, but the storyline, the character development, everything is really what brought you into it. The second one, the combat system was still flawed, though a lot faster paced. And the third one, the combat system I thought was probably its best out of the three. This one, there is a little bit of an issue with cover in some cases, but more or less the combat is fucking ridiculous. It is, is so challenging at this point. I have it on normal. I played these games on hardcore difficulty, didn't have much of a problem, and on normal in the first area I almost got killed a bunch of times. It's really high paced. The storyline is what you would expect from Bioware and what you would expect from Mass Effect. Even though it's not Shepard and all that, it's still starting to really feel like a Mass Effect game, which I'm really impressed with seeing as how they've taken characters and individuals and species and everything and brought it to a new galaxy. I'm also really interested in this idea of exploration, which we did lose a lot of. I mean, I'm not really going to go nuts about Mass Effect 3, because that was more like trying to survive. But more Mass Effect 2, there was a, a loss of that sense of exploration as you had in 1. Now, we didn't, didn't get into the vehicle yet. I still know what's going on with the Nexus yet. The multiplayer is also what it was in 3. Just, again, more high... I mean, I'm playing bronze, and you're overwhelmed by enemies. It's... This new species called the Ket is really interesting. They look kind of like collectors, but without the four eyes. And their technology seems to be so far advanced for anything we've gotten used to in the previous games. The weapons are your old weapons that you came from. But again, don't forget, we haven't even touched anything with this game. I haven't even scraped the surface. So from what I've played so far, it's intriguing. I like a lot of the characters. I've also laughed a few times already at some of the lines being said. I did notice that there is a lot of difference, or a little bit of a difference even, between the dialogue from when you play as the sister and when you play as the brother. So a lot of the game itself that I've seen so far at first started off a little slow, but at this point it's really kicked itself in the ass, and man, I am looking forward to playing this game. I cannot wait to see where we're going with this. And really, like I said, because I've been playing Horizon Zero Dawn, seeing as how Horizon Zero Dawn really takes place in like an ancient civilization type atmosphere, this new futuristic setting is really, really exciting for me. So at this point, I'm really looking forward to seeing where this game's going. And thank you all for watching. I have more for you soon to come. So stay tuned, take care, and have a great day. A superhero fighting game and a 3DS game all on the same day. Kind of.